What is going on everybody, it's your boy Demnus Gaming here and in today's video I'm going to be showing you the new gun that came out a couple of days ago and I just wanted to make a really good video on this I was grinding out for hours on the weekend trying to get some good gameplay and as you can see here I got the Trencher Gamma Legendary in a supply job and it's a common supply job too so yeah today I'll be, I'll be showcasing this gun called the Trencher as you saw earlier in the supply job, you saw what it was called. So the Trencher is a really, really good submachine gun, and it reminds me of a really old gun from I'm not sure what Call of Duty it was. I'll try and find it on Google, but I've used this gun before, and I believe this gun was actually in Shadows of Evil in Black Ops 3 Zombies. It's the first map that you get that comes with zombies on Black Ops 3, and there's a gun that looks exactly like this, where your left hand holds the magazine on the side and then your right hand is obviously pulling the trigger. This submachine gun is really good and I love using this gun so much and I'm so lucky that I got this very good lobby because these people were so oblivious to what was going on like I was jumping around like no tomorrow and you can see in this bit right here I'm just jumping around clutching it and I got my UAV and also my counter UAV. So I was going off in this lobby because, like I said, they were just really, really blind, you know what I mean? Like, they just did not know what was going on. And I got one clean warden in this gameplay. Very clean, and in the next gameplay, I have for you a two warden gameplay, which I was going for, man. And I actually got it the second time. The first time I recorded, technically, was recording. So the first time, I wanted to get a double warden gameplay which I did after three hours or so and I'm like oh yes very good gameplay two wardens let's go so I wanted to upload it I went to go flashback record on my Elgato which is basically when you drag the cursor and you pretty much go back in time and your Elgato actually if you live on your Elgato it does a live recording but at the same time it doesn't record unless you drag back the timeline and then you click record and it goes back to you know where you are supposed to be at anyway so sorry about me ranting on about that but I flash back record and it said that the file was missing and I'm like what the hell I just missed out on this gameplay and it says that it's gone like how does, how does that just happen so it got me so pissed off Elgato, you need to update your bug fixes, like seriously, that is rubbish. I got a good gameplay, and this is what the Elgato is supposed to be used for. It's supposed to be used for recording gameplay, and every single YouTuber, if not most, alright, sorry, um, <laughs> they use the Elgato for their gameplays, and I'm just, I was just so upset, you know, and right now I'm okay, obviously, I forgot about it, but that same day, a couple hours later, I got a double warden gameplay again and yeah I'm very happy for that guys so enjoy the rest of the video I won't be talking for a while but you know in the next video I will see you guys then oh and before I forget I'll do this video as if it's like a class setup video because I haven't done those in ages and I also just want to make two video videos in one so I'll title this video basically the new trencher gun submachine gun in infinite warfare plus with a class setup. So I'll put a photo on screen on the second bit of gameplay and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.